Hey guys, uh, Yagra here, and welcome back to Amnesia The Dark Descent Story. Uh, it sure has been a while, last, uh, it sure has been a while since uh, last time we continued our research on this place. So, oh yeah, I forgot. I am down here. Okay, uh, question. Which one, which way is up and which, which way is down? Okay, so I came from that direction. Hmm. Alrighty then. The Cellar Archives. Oh. Crushed the crust. Uh, hmm. Um. I'm <laughs> what the? Oh. Uh. What the? What? Wait, 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 what? Oh. Um. There's something. There's a lever. Don't. Jeez. Here's the Bible. Take the word of the Lord. Okay, so you don't care about the word of the Lord. Uh. Oh. Don't mind me. 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 Up, up, up to the whatever this is. Just this is loud. Jeez. Uh, well, I'm I'm wasting my oil. Oh God, on this. Would you kindly? No. Away. Um, why is this? Is this locked because I didn't manage to get through? The heavy gate. The gate is too heavy. There must be some. Uh, there must be an opening mechanism. Well, duh. Do have anything to throw with that? Mind me, Daniel, run, please. It's right behind me, isn't it? Up, oh. gotcha. Ah, at least I thought I did. Go eat some breakfast. My oil is going to run out. But this is not helpful. <laughs> yes, oil. Pick up you, yes, yes I can. Oh. Please read. 
Please reach. Okay, that explains the water. That was un unpleasant. Help. More water. Until you get through the door. Stop on the way. I cannot know where I'm going. Off. Out of the way, please. Let me have it. Dark hall. Yes. I survived. Just barely with my life. Is this another dream? That depends on what you talk. Oh. Great. Now I can turn this off. It... It just happened to... What the... Um... Okay. Great. Tell me more. Where does this live? Where does this lead? Storage. Hmm. Oh, oh no. I have a bad feeling about the storage room. I can. I have a bad feeling in my gut. What the? F what the? Darkness of the store. This darkness in the storage feels uh, strange and unnatural. What are you talking about? I can barely see... Oh, hold on. Graphics. I can barely see anything. Okay, so this... oil perhaps what is going on over here oh no I can barely see anything I don't want to waste all of my boxes well this is this isn't a uh, this isn't an animus at all this is not scary at all. Tinder boxes. Oh no. Get out of the darkness, Daniel. Sanity is crystal clear. I doubt it. What? Machines and parts. Please, let me go. I won't tell anyone. I swear. I just want to go Okay. Somebody. Somebody experienced some unwanted company. Drill. Nope. I swear I saw something. Oh yeah, the reason why my sounds are so loud is because my headphones are full, 
Oh, full on volume. I just swear I saw something. Sanity, a slight headache. I doubt that this is a slight headache. I swear I saw something. If that thing is outside... Why do you have to open it so widely? I'll keep it I sh I'll keep it slightly open if I have to go inside again. What the hell? How many dinner boxes do I have? Five. Oh my god. Machines and parts was in this direction. What is this? Equipment. Why do I have a bad feeling of going down? Daniel, if you're losing your sanity, I swear to... S I swear to Alexandria. Or Alexander. I swear the name of Alexander. You deserve... Slight headache. I swear to Alexander... That you deserve... Deserve whatever... Gets in your way. I can see. That door is slightly open, so... I'm not going in there. It's just for the sake of my health. Don't open it so quickly, Daniel, please. What is this? Is this... Are these bricks? What? Tinderbox. I'm just... Hopefully no one hears me. Okay. Feather brain servant. <laughs> I'll keep all the doors once I can't in them. What is going on with the woman? So that. So there are two doors that are slightly open and one door that isn't slightly open. Valve is rust rusted shut. I don't like this, Daniel. And if this if there's water again, I. I swear on my mother. Yeah, it doesn't actually, it does not matter if I put these in front of it because it opens outwards, not inwards. Oh no, 
Oh, Christ. Christ Almighty. Please don't come here. Actually, I'm doing this for safety reasons. Oops. Some items can be combined. Can't assemble drill yet. You need to find all first. Uh, all parts first. Okay, um, great. No monsters, please. So there are only there are only two doors left. This one. Okay, so it's me. And this one. I don't, I really don't like this. Okay, Daniel, are you losing your mind? I don't like the sound. more small uh, carpenters uh, drill all right what am I going to do with this oh great there are bones here hmm it won't budge of course it won't what machine parts I got a memento the rumble from the cave-in is hindering a future pa uh, further passage into the storage. I just were there. Find another way to get through. Uh, I just were... I just was there. Okay. Can I drill this thing open? I'll just take my leave because I just cannot be here anymore. Okay, girl. Why, what? Your unfortunate demise was not my problem. Unfortunately. Climb out of the bed, look out the window. Is it completely dark? Hmm. Four o'clock. It's enough. Okay, so what was this? This was the storage. I'm not sure if, if it meant that I needed to blow something up. Actually, I'll keep it. I'll keep it wide open. That was the direction I came from. This is the direction I'll go in. Oh. oh, hello. What? You have an ascending room. Will it take us to the inner sanctum? It will definitely take care of the vertical part of our journey. So, you have ridden an elevator before? Yes, the Colosseum at Regent's Park has one. It takes you to the gallery where you can view the panorama. Good. This ride might be a little longer. And in the other direction. Okay. What's next? This is study. And this is the guest room. Let's go to the guest room first. He tried to shift it a piece, but like the... what? My journal is gone. What would they want with my journal? Hmm. 
That's a good question. I do not know. Maybe because you have some... It's cold. It's so cold. The lock is stuck to the broken. Yes, oil. Second of July, 1839. I received a letter today from the Algerian governor's office disclosing the fate of Herbert's expedition. About a week after my departure, Abdullah, one of the men traveling with us, returned from the desert. He was badly injured, as if maimed by a lion. The man rambled deliriously about the expedition being attacked by something horrible. The French quickly dispatched a search party to look for the expedition. After searching for days, they found the camp abandoned without any trace of Herbert or his men. Tomorrow, I'll retrieve the things they recovered from Herbert's tent at the customs house. I don't know what to make of it, but I'm worried for him. Okay. Things didn't go as well. Third of July, 1839. Today I picked up Herbert's things at the customs house. I dug through the trove of documents he had carried and found a log detailing the expedition. The nature of this text ranged from quick notes to colorful accounts of transpired events. I skimmed the pages trying to figure out what might have happened. May 17th, the day I was trapped inside the orb chamber, Herbert dryly states, we covered Daniel after one hour of entrapment. This confused me greatly. I was suffocating within minutes. How could I have lasted an hour? I continued reading the peculiar text. Herbert states his facts without judgment or passion, but suddenly I could read frustration into his text. He pushed his men to investigate the underground tomb, an effort which seems to have strained the minds of his men. Madness spread through the ranks, and Herbert had to take some extreme measures to continue. He finally visits the chamber himself, where he retrieves the orb to the surface. His account confuses me greatly. If he has the orb, what are those pieces in my drawing room? Hmm. That is a certainly a good question. A crowbar. Nothing but your clothes. And nothing. Let's break this uh, door down. And... Sure, shit, they sure did bust through the door. Oh, my goodness. Fourth of July, eighteen thirty nine. It's done. The orb is assembled. I was awakened by an exhausting nightmare. Shaking and sweating, I retired to the drawing room with a cup of tea. 
The relic pieces lay spread across the table as I'd left them, but somehow I knew how it was supposed to be. I fetched the tar, which I had prepared to fix the pieces together, and without fault I joined them, producing the orb I remembered so clearly. The tar proved unnecessary. It was pushed out from the joining pieces as they merged on their own, with no adhesive. The ancient stone relic now rests on my table. Its immaculate surface and perfect shape could have been molded by a factory. This is all too strange. All right. I think I'm going to end the episode soon. I'm going to just find the damn key or something. Anyway, I'm going to end the episode over here. We're going to return to the back hall. Hopefully that thing isn't there. Oh god. And then... We'll see you again... Next time. Hope you enjoyed. If you did, that great. If you didn't, then I apologize. But until then, peace, Yagura out.